Hello and welcome back to some more Fairy Tale Fables. We are, um, well, we're getting into a normal game, but uh, things are not going too well today. I haven't had a single one. Uh, I didn't win a single game today, and I played this game with a fluff. It's again, I, I I think that's probably one of the last times I'm gonna go for fluff. Well, I say that, and it's probably gonna happen again. And I don't quite understand Pen Dragon either here, so. Didn't work out, 5 out of 8, and that seems to be the deal with Fluff. I, even when I do get Fluffs, I don't get them big enough. It's just not happening. 6 out of 8, 2 out of 8, that's the best run today. Cat run, probably. Eh, I say that, maybe this one was the best one. That was the last episode I actually did put out. So, not a good day so far, I would say. Well, I'm still plus in the ranking, so I'm, I'm happy with that. Especially with how hard the bolts are now, so yeah. Bearskin, Guanjin, um, I, I could not get her to work. It's very hard to get Guanjin to work for some reason. I've lost, I think I've lost a lot by taking her. Uh, Artemis, Arias, Bearskin, I think it's between Arias and Bearskin. I want to go Arias, I think. Yeah, let's go Arias. All right, so we have a lot of lee room here because he got one, two already and do attack first is there anything here that i want well the owl looks pretty good to be honest just because of we can cast the spell and just boom that's a 2-2 and we are all and we have another owl with a demon steel next round that seems pretty good to me i'll take that i don't often go owl anymore but on a guy like this where i don't really feel like we are struggling too much in the early stages of the game. I can definitely do it also when we see stuff like that. Uh, yes, and do that and take the imp. Or oh, reroll. I think we'll reroll instead of... <laughs> that was a good choice. That was a good choice. I guess we'll take the cat maybe. Or the th I mean, we could start scaling quite heavily here, but I think the cat might be better. I could have taken. Uh, yeah, I should probably take this route, but I don't feel I don't feel like going to scaling units here. So yeah, we're looking for spells basically now. Um, well, we're looking for a treasure for mana or something like that. One extra mana would be good. Well, there it is. Sure, I'll take it. Just because we got an all. Let's get it up. Let's get it big. Um. And we're also looking for the one that gives attack damage so we can get more out of barriers. That would also be good. I guess that could be a proc next turn, but I think I'll rather look for something else in tier 3. Yeah, just take that and probably reroll again. Alright, that's also half decent, but we're definitely we need more units. Clearly, we need more units, but we are gonna take tier 3 units. Maybe demons, if we could get demons, right? Uh, well, yeah, okay, fair enough. We actually... Uh, no, we didn't win it, but <coughs> time. Okay, we do have a demon. We also have cats. I'm very tempted to go for a cat here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go cats. Do this and reroll. Fluff. I'm not gonna go fluff again. Uh, this seems okay to do, I suppose. Uh, on the sleeping cats, obviously. And then maybe re-roll again for another spell. Okay. Not terrible. Sure. More cats. I'm actually gonna lock that in, also because there is a calling it. Fox. Maybe we could call it on the fox. Yeah, I mean, getting another scaling unit that is Slay. I mean, this one is not going to stay there. It's going to be another cat next turn. But yeah, for this turn alone, it's not terrible. Getting the fox, I suppose. Okay, there we go. Didn't take any damage, which is nice. When we don't have a... When we don't have more than this out there, it's pretty good. Take the cats. Take... Oh, we can actually... Hmm. I think I should just have more board presence here and I can kind of look past that calling it. 
But we could also re-roll. I mean, I would rather actually, I would rather do this and re-roll. I think this cat might be worth it. Just a bit of it, an extra body in there. We can still re-roll, so I, yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. Uh, that's fine, I suppose. I guess that's fine. Yeah, okay. Fine, 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 fine. Didn't, we're not really spending all the mana here, which has always been my problem with this kind of thing. But... Yeah. Uh, if we get another treasure that has the, you know, less gold, more mana thing as well, that could be something where we could get more. Well, we do actually get a tier 3 here. The egg also seems pretty decent. But it depends on this treasure we will see here. But the egg does seem pretty good. Every three characters you sell, the characters in your shop have plus two plus two. Your character in 14 health seems pretty damn big here. I'll take Arius. That's a big old owl. That's a very big owl. Or maybe cat actually. Might even be better to have the cats here to be honest. <laughs> Just because we get more out of it. We get more out of the health basically. Uh, the egg seems fairly good for tempo. So does the consti. I'm gonna re-roll instead. Maybe another spell word could be funky, but we don't really have. Nah, I think we're just gonna go for. Hmm. I guess the uh, dog is also interesting here. It, yes, it's a tier two, but uh, the acolyte because we're casting a lot of spells. It is arranged, and we do have a range slot, but we don't really have enough to cast any spells this turn. Mm, that's not very tempo based, is it? <laughs> oh, we could buy a shield. Mm. Ah, I mean, I could do this and still roll, I suppose. But I don't really want to log in the next shop. Or I don't want to log in a shop when we are almost here for here. So I guess we're just going to do this and just put this on maybe the owl. Didn't really like this shop that much. That was not really the best shop in the world. Well, we did get areas, which is really good for tempo. So, we didn't even lose our cat here. Wow. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got a lot of health out there, so it should be good. We could get even more damage out there. Or duelist. Range boost. Definitely taking that one. I think we're just gonna roll on that shop. Um, I could take things here, but I'm also just... Nah, we could also just keep looking for things. Boost seems pretty good with all the cats. I am not against that. Or two, we could get... Nah, it's not the best spell in the world, but... I think I'm okay with boost here. 23, yeah. The boot, yeah, the cats are actually maybe... Uh, we do have a room free for the cats to come out into, but yeah. All right. Uh, do we take this or do we roll on it? I think we take it. It's basically securing us the... Yeah, it should be. I mean, they do have a pirate build here, so it could be a big unit coming out. 918 pirate. Wow. And hands. Okay, I think we're good. If we just do this... That should pretty much guarantee it. Uh, another cat. Crap, another cat here. Hmm. Well, we also have a Rapunzel. I think we're going to lock that in and take some more cats, actually. And a Rapunzel. That spell also seems pretty good next turn. In all honesty, that looks really good. Uh, right now, we're really, really um, solid. We are um, We're looking quite good. I mean, we don't have a build. We need, we need to start looking for a build, but otherwise we're looking really good. We're doing a lot of damage and stuff, so that's always good. He's looking for a new character with a doll. But yeah, just doing this and just keep rolling with that. Do I even... I don't think I want the cats. I just want to do this. Put it on the owl. It's going to be the one we're going to keep the longest. Lightning strike. Yeah, I don't think so. 
I'm just wondering if there is anything else I want to do here. I'll just should I just do this and just keep. I mean, it's it's old. We are okay. In this in this case, it might be worth doing the lightning strike, killing his egg potentially, or an owl. Actually, anything up there could be dead, and then also the back line. I think it's worth it just because of how his line is looking up. Uh, we do have a cat chore and another cat here. I think we're going cats. Seems like a good idea. We can get rid of the acolyte and the boosting is also good for the cats. Yeah, let's, let's go cats. Let's go cats here. It seems like a good idea with what we already have. And we can still go spells pretty heavy on the owl, I guess. As long as we find some... Yeah, that was a... I didn't even see what it hit, but I, I can tell it was pretty good when we have... <laughs> oh, that was, that was something, wasn't it? That was something. <laughs> oh, that was disgusting. Ah, uh, fried egg. Nah, don't think so. Hmm. We are against the dead person, so we basically have a free round here. We don't need to cast this spell at all or anything. Yeah, let's do that. Tier 4 this should be good. When you cast the spell, which costs um, at most two gold, repeat it one time. That is very good. I'll take the double cast here because we have the more mana that we have. Things we're working with. This costs four armor? And what? When you buy a spell, which costs at most two. Ah, when it costs at most two, it will be repeated. Okay, so this one would actually be repeated if we could get it. Which I kind of like to do, but it would mean we need to get rid of this or. It's actually worth it. It's it's actually worth it. It is actually worth doing that. It's it's massive, right? It's it's a lot of damage. Uh, let's leave a bit of room for that cat to spawn in too, so we get more out of that summoning. Well, actually, it might not die first, but maybe I should just have this one here. But that would also summon twice, so let's just do that instead. Uh, cat there, range. I guess we could put it up here, but it's probably better in the back line. Yeah, probably better in the back line. All right. So he he's already dead. So we just need to get through this one without taking any damage, please. Oh, he's not dead. He's he got three health. What? I thought he was dead. Hmm. A lot of value out of our uh, areas. A lot of value out of that boosting. We are looking quite good here. And we do have a you know, we, we have a direction for the cats as well here. L lots of summonings for the oh he actually didn't get a lot because he died early, but whatever. We do have a direction for sure here. And also with a good combination of spells we can put on probably the cat. Destroy a character to get one. Nah, not really worth it. We're definitely looking for something here. I'll know when I see it. Mm, yeah, I mean, it's definitely not bad. Let's put the owl over here, I think, for a bit more early damage. Uh, no, I don't. We can still get some spells here. That could be good. Ah, nah. Guess we'll take that instead. Put it out there instead of the acolytes, so we can potentially get it up and running really early. All right, that's pretty good. I can't complain about this run so far. He also, oh, okay, he. This could be a. Ooh, it's gonna be a tricky one to win actually, because you also have more summonings coming out. So far, so good. Oh, there we go. No, we're definitely gonna lose this. Well, maybe not. Oh, yeah, there we go. Nice. That was a good hit. I was a bit lucky as well. We actually kicked him out. That's very, very good. That's very, very good. We kicked him out. Uh, so we're definitely looking for a top four placement here. Romeo and Juliet build should be okay for us to deal with. Mm, nope. That is not bad. Put it on the owl. Oh, maybe on the... Guess this one instead now. Steal. We could start stealing from the cats that we are summoning. But definitely not bad over here because we could keep, keep stealing. It's 4-4. Four, four. I mean, 4-4 four, four every single turn. It's not bad, but I think we're just looking for spells instead or more cats. That's definitely better than that one, but I'd rather not take another one of those. 
that is it. Seven, seven. Who are we up against? Odin here. Hmm. Do we want a bigger just for it to not die? Maybe. Sure. Love. More food. I guess we'll take that. It's not terrible. We could kill something here early on, which is actually better killing them early than letting them hit the Romeo and Juliet. Sure. Oh, it's only the ones that cost maximum two. It's casting one more time. I forget, I forget about that. I completely forgot about that. But it also, it, this one is repeated twice, if I'm not mistaken. Or maybe not. Yeah, it should be. It should be. All right, let's go. Let's see if it repeats itself too, twice here. It did. Okay, but it didn't kill anything. I think this is going to be one of those that we're probably not going to win. Yeah, we got really unlucky with the hits on the owl there. Uh, it's going to be very close, actually. We are going to have oh, two health left. Dang it. Close. Catnip upgrade for a tier 5? Sure. I don't even... I don't even know what we could potentially get that would be... Well, that's a couple of things, I guess. 15. That's pretty big for him because he's starting out with attacking. When one of your characters dies, charge one star. If I'm in position 1, double your hero's underlying power. So, I guess he will attack twice. I think the Silver Cross here is fairly good instead of the mana, extra mana here. I think I'm, yeah, sure, why not? I mean, it's 19 two times that we're just gonna pump out there and, you know, do damage with. I think that's pretty decent. Uh, we're looking for more cats and also probably something like. Mm, no. This, yes. Another cat here. Don't really. Uh, he's. Nah. You're just looking for cats here. Okay, that's again another character we need in there after this. Tier 4. I don't think we can get anything here we actually want. Well, your spells cost 1 gold less. You have 5 more mana. That's fairly decent, I would say. Instead of the areas, but... The areas is giving us a lot of port presence, but maybe we don't need that anymore. Uh, at the start of each fight, cast a random combat spell. I would... Nah, that's not really working with that one. The characters have 1, 2, 3. Two. I think we're gonna take the Odin's Raven here instead of areas. Just because it works really well with the double caster. Yeah. And we also have five more mana along with that. So yeah, that seems pretty good. Just cast a lot of spells here. So well, now we have seven mana. Yeah. Um, sure. I think we're going to re-roll here. Another catnip. I don't think we're going to take another catnip. I think we're looking for the... Uh, box thing. Yes, for this turn we are... No, nah, I still... This is probably still better. Maybe we want the yellow. Nah, yeah, maybe. I don't know. I think I think we still want the cat that's coming. So we got more value out of uh, Prince Rapunzel here. Alright, yeah. I think we're good with that. Um, so, next, next turn we are looking for the... Um, yeah, 100% looking for... The cabinet now. And the cat queen. Those two. That is what we're looking for. And just lots of spells, basically. To keep upgrading the owl. Not that that's very important, but also just getting... Wow, well, it's actually a tie. Okay. But also for... Uh, for keep buffing the, the cat chore and, you know, stuff like that. See, this is like two times, right? Yeah, it cost one. And we do does it twice, so that's already 10 damage extra right there. 52 for one goal and one mana. That's pretty decent. Uh, that's also about to six health. No, we will rather do the spells. Nocturne. Nah, just, just go find the queen. Just go find the queen. That's pretty decent. Oh, actually, it doesn't do anything. Except for spending my mana. <laughs> it didn't. It didn't do it. <laughs> that's completely wrong. Nope, uh, fluff. Nope, nope, nope. That is... 
may be worth it. No, he's no, no, it's not. We don't have anyone we want to upgrade, so it's definitely not worth it. Uh, yeah, we'll do that 100%. There we go. Uh, this one, yes. This one, yes. Uh, this one costs three, but it's 15 health. Mm, maybe worth it. Sure. Uh, sure. And then re-roll, I think. Yeah, we don't really want to... Well, we have two left, but... Who are we up against? We're up against the dead character, so... I, no, I'd, I'd rather have the mana for something else, actually. Unfortunately, we didn't find... Yeah, the cabinet or the cat queen, but... There is still time for that. There is still time for that. That seems reasonable for six gold, but probably not. <laughs> it's just, I don't think it. I mean, yes, the owl is very big now, but I still don't feel like actually they're going to be. Uh, yeah, probably the owl is going to be. It depends. It depends. It, I don't know if they're going to be staying in there. That's pretty big. That's a, that's a big. Uh, that's a big unit to get right now. Sure. Could also have gotten rid of the cat, but. Nah, I'll, I'll keep the cat. I'll keep the 1-1 one, one cat for now. <laughs> Alright, cool. Decent shop, decent shop. Lots of uh, spells. Uh, pretty big uh, magic units, which probably is going to help us with the uh, board presence here for... We should actually turn them around. But so far, so good. Oh, he's dead, yeah. But it's going to be the... Uh, there's probably going to be some... I don't feel like we have a winning board right now, but we have a very good board. Uh, we just needed to turn it into a winning board. We take a look at Odin here. Not a winning board. Could be a winning board. Yeah, it's probably Tinkerbell. I'm worried about Tinkerbell here. Uh, the dwarves could go crazy if she finds the right characters. You could have uh, big, 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 big units. Slay, no. Don't have anything here. But we are looking quite good for the win. The wolf bait is actually not bad. Because we have more summonings that way. But we don't have the cabinet to put it on, but it's I don't think it's worth it in this specific spot. Phoenix is kind of interesting because it's also a summoning, but you want to spend six gold on that rather than keep rolling for the cat queen and the I don't think it's worth it. There we are. That should very much help <laughs> very much so help us out. If it's a free goal, but it's a 14 damage. We definitely could put that on him. All right, we are looking for cabinet now. I'll take another one, I guess. Hmm. I mean, we do already boost them, but yeah, I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth it. But. We do have a fairly good board right now. It's pretty big, and we are only really looking for the cabinet. Maybe a witch queen or something like that. Uh, I guess we could... No, we can't. Well, yes, no, yes, no. Do we want this out there instead? Probably not. We are against Odin. Yeah, we probably should cast this. I don't, I'm not going to play this cat. So let's just cast that. It's also going to be two times. So that's probably really good if we hit something good here. Eee! We hit the... Yeah, that was really good, actually. We hit the sleigh back here. And uh, one of the... Um, Juliet. I think we got this. Yeah. Cool. But only one time. He could still get... I mean, that could be still a good board later on. There is the cabinet. I think we got it now. I think he's coming out. I don't think he's worth it. Have the cabinet back here. Yes, 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 yes. Or maybe not. Let's have it back here. And... Hmm, I guess we're moving the owl over here. Actually, also that over here. So we have the this coming out. And we have the summoning of two. No, it's actually four cats. Four cats? Is it really four cats? Is the cat box four cats? 
Okay, I did. I did. I thought it was two cats. Maybe they changed that in the last uh, patch. I think it. I think that was changed in the last patch because I'm 100 percent sure it was two cats before. Huh? Fine. Sure. I mean, sure. <laughs> uh, reroll for another cabinet. Why wouldn't it? Why not? Why not? And I guess we are gonna sell. I don't think we are gonna. Are we gonna sell this cat? I mean, it's. We don't even need it anymore, do we? Just to get the tier 6 going. I mean, the queen could also come out, but no, we're gonna... Ah, dang it. How do we get this? How do we get this? We'll use that. Uh, what is that? Aura? Yeah, we're gonna lock that in. I guess since we're already locking it in, we might as well just... No, we would like to get it this turn. We would definitely like to get it this turn. The problem is, we're gonna have one left spot spot in there but i'm not gonna use this anymore and we're not gonna use that anymore take this get it in there and next turn we can take the hour for the queen sure right sure uh i just thought of remove range and on yielding yeah, not really any of this the hero has three attack counts merlin's lesson at the start of the fight each fight cast fireball Nope. I think we're gonna re-roll that. Could we could get something we want, so I'll re-roll it. Well go. Yeah, definitely this for the queen next turn, and then we I don't know, we're looking for something here. We'll see. I think we're good with one less unit in there for now because we got that upgraded supply cabinet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No problems here. No problems at all. That dwarf was this. This was actually, I think, today. Today, I think this run has been the easiest. Also, because I was a bit lucky, but also in terms of their boards, they are not very strong. They, this is this was probably the weakest opponents I've seen in terms of an in-game kind of situation. It, it, it wasn't really great. I just spent all of the gold here. <laughs> we still have a, a missing character. Actually, put the cabinet here instead. In... Nah, just put it here. It, it doesn't really matter in this situation. Is it two? Yeah, it, it is summoning two, but it doesn't really matter if, where it's coming out. Alright. Uh... Nah. Mm, no, not really. Not really. Hmm, boost. Nah. I mean, this could be interesting for the cats, I suppose, but... Demon. Haymaker? Nah. Nah, let's just start the fight here. I don't... I've, yeah, nah. I also think we win this fairly easily without... Yeah, I think, I think he's just gonna take 10 damage here. Ah, uh, maybe not, maybe not. I was a little bit too quick there. I was a little bit too quick. Let's see. Ah, uh, it might be 10 damage. Let's see. It was. It was actually 11 damage. So there we go. That was probably the easiest victory after the patch I've had. Actually, by far. By far. The easiest. That was, uh... Concerningly easy. <laughs> <laughs> this was it didn't feel exactly like the runs was before the patch but it was definitely the most easy run that i've had out of i don't know 20 25 runs uh after the patch uh, maybe 20 runs so yeah there we go another cat run but it was uh definitely a yeah i don't even know what to say here it's just it, this seemed a little bit strange to me um this didn't seem competitive well I'm saying that, but all the other runs that I had today was definitely competitive. So I'll just take the win and run away with it and say, good, good, good. The cats are still working. And I got a little bit lucky here with the cabinets and the cat queen. And basically everything went really well in this fight. Maybe, you know what? You know what, what happened here as well? I made a ton of damage. On the early board, right? On the on the other guys, the the other uh, players that was in here, I made a ton of damage to them. So maybe the one or two or maybe three boards that was really really solid 
in there, they might die off really early because they were maybe scaling really heavily or something like that for the late game. So maybe some of the best boards that was actually in here died because we had a really solid early game. That could be. And that's why I want to go for uh, tempo every single time because you could kick some of those guys out that are really going strong later on. So you want to kick out people as fast as humanly possible you can. Make 10 damage early on to someone and that could hurt him very badly um, in the mid game, right? So I, that, that could have happened here. It could have happened because the, 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 the boards we saw here at the end, they were not really strong. They were not late game builds at all. Roman and Juliet is not a late game build. It's just not. <laughs> So, and uh, the dwarf, he did, he didn't get there. The, the dwarf build didn't get there at all. He didn't get the tier sixes he needed. So I think we just killed off the good boards, basically. I think that's what happened. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, we actually won with uh, without a spot here. In the, it was just too easy, but I, it might have been too easy because we did really well early on. That's what I'm trying to say. Anyway, hope to see you around next time.